the fucks? Oh, back to radiation. That's great. Did a bomb get dropped down here? What lore am I missing? Or was that radiation truck just that bad? Data. World map. Okay. Cool. I have no clue where we're going. But we're going somewhere. Whoa! Where? Hello? Goodbye. Good night. No! We're all the way back here. No. Ah. Uh. Are you kidding me? Oh, we're gonna have to deal with the scorpions again? Are you kidding me? Run! Run! Stop limping, run! Fix your limp, please. Heal, whatever you gotta do, do it. Uh, dog, haste! Haste! Oh, we're outrunning the encounter. That's new. I never knew we could do that. Stop. Stop. Ah! Ah! Okay, I didn't want to do this. Sorry, doggy. Bet you'll make for some good food, though. Nothing in here? Just a an abandoned building, kind of like the ones the super mutants roam in, in the city? Nothing to see there. Um, okay, so we died up there last time. Why, why don't we push up there, see where that guy was with his rocket launcher, and what if we rocket launcher him first? We could play that type of game, if he's going to play that game. Vault 112, I'm coming for you, but first, I want to bomb somebody. And I want to bomb them hard. Okay, ow, ow, buddy. I didn't realize I'd be fighting already. Calm down with the encounter, homie. I've got to sneak around. If we're lucky, they'll be dumb, they, and they won't know how to get us. But last time, we did get shot out of nowhere with a missile, so who knows? They could be extremely intelligent. Danger. Oh, it's him. It's him. It's you. Ah, oh, I knew it. You're not hurt by that? Broski, you have every bit of respect for me right now. Oh, it's a talent group, huh? Ah! And they shot off my leg after I was dead. That's just mean. Okay, we're gonna need auto save once we get a bit closer to that because I'm tired of dying. I'm just gonna go ahead and do all of that. I'm addicted. I'm addicted to whiskey now too. I just got addicted to everything. Dog. Come on. That sucks. Okay, if you're like, hey, why are you going right? You don't have to go that way. You could just go to the vault. I like doing extra stuff. Uh-huh, how about that? I like doing extra stuff, eh? Okay. So last time, uh, we went that way, and then we got a bit past it and died to, like, a raider encampment up in there. Uh, so let's just see if we can walk this. I know there were super mutants kind of nearby. Oh, God. Okay. You're making me feel bad.
bad for this doggy. Doggy, stop hitting me. I really don't like you. You're so fast. Salt off shotgun, combat shotgun, whatever. Whatever. Hey! Hey! Stop! Whoa. A bullet whizzed by my head. And by whiz, I don't mean piss. I mean. I flew by? Whiz? Whizzed hard? Okay. Super Mutant Encounter, here we go. Oh. Oh, you almost killed your boy. What, why'd you do that? Ah. Headshot. Ah. Get away. I'll melee you. Fight me like a man. Huh. Huh. Yeah, take that. Oh. Oh, one big hit. Ow. You do a lot of damage, buddy. I should not be doing this fight. All right, what do we do here? Let's finish him off with that. It's probably not the best move, but it is what it is. Sledgehammer, where are we at? There we go. Best ones at 66 value. Let's put those back on him. Let's exit. Snipe this guy. They're pretty weak to uh, hunting rifle damage or critical hits. I don't know what their weakness is, but I'm just saying. From a first time we're playing the game, it seems like they're good. Oh, okay. I'm shooting a tree. I was going to say, it seems like they do a lot of damage, but I wouldn't know. Buddy, stop. You're ruining the game. One shot and you're a legend. You get me. Is he still out there? Look. I need some ammo, Robo. I want to scream. Guys, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I should be saving more often. That's everything I wanted right there. Just drink it all. Now we're running. I don't even care. I do not care. We will get by every single person. Every single one of them. What's over here? Super mutant? Dude, there's no way you should have seen me. Absolutely no shot. Okay, if you're going to chase, dude, just keep doing it, but I'm going to get away from you. Okay, we just need to keep going. Avoid everything. Everything. I take back what I said about side stuff. I can't do it right now. I just healed. I just healed. Stop. I can't die. I can't take any damage. I just healed up. Literally, I cannot risk that right now. Oh. Save. Somebody keep reminding me in the comments. Tell me save, dumbass. Okay, let's keep moving. We know those guys aren't as quick as us.
This hill seems pretty safe, though. I know the raider encampment's kind of, like, down inside the valley. So I think this might... Oh, what is that place? That's huge. Wait, is 112 in there? Don't tell me it's in there. No, it's past it. It's definitely past it. Unless the entrance to the uh, underground area does go through there. I mean, you never know with these games. The metro station like takes you 20 places, so who knows. Just me in the wasteland, huh? Sitting back. Edging until I'm Sigma. Don't. Don't ever clip that. That's not going to be a part of my legacy. I I've never said that. Oh, this sucks. This is a hot spring of radiation. Oh, yeah, that really sucks. Dad, why would you travel out this far? You're quite the madman to be walking through ooze and goo. Military brigade. Yeah, before we go to that vault, let's look at this. Some dead body right here. What is this? Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. I stepped on it. Crushed him. He disintegrated. Excuse me? Whoa! Whoa! Hey! Mr. Gutsy? I'm not in the mood to fight right now. Okay. Mintat's withdrawal. That's awesome. I'm, I'm a tweaker for life, baby. Tweak till I geek. Oh, he is killing me so quickly. No, you guys should have warned me about him. Somebody, please, t t send this bad signal if stuff like this happens. Oh, no, I wish we had energy weapon ammo. I'm not a commie, dude. Literally not a commie. I'm the furthest thing away from it. I am a vault dweller, right? which is pretty common. One more hit. It's the only high damage thing I have. Okay. Energy cell, flavor fuel. You had nothing, brother. Mr. Gutsy, you had nothing. You didn't even have healing for having a medical sounding name. Does this even have healing? Laser rifle, thanks. Police baton, tin can. Oh. That's so sad. Oh, we can sleep to heal, I forgot. W. W. <laughs> w sleep. All right, this is the wasteland at 3 a.m. Who are you guys? Hey, Bro local, shouldn't you be banging rocks together or something? Brotherhood Outcast? Hello. Outcast Robo Brain? No time to talk to your type, local. Local, hey. No time to talk to your type, local. Okay, fine, whatever. Move on with your day. You're a very interesting trio, and I was just going to compliment on the nature of reality and how strange it is, but continue with what you want. I assume this is 12? Or 112? Smith Casey's garage? What? Wait a minute. Is there a hidden vault? Oh, I hear something. In fact, it's quite a lot. Can we sneak up on him with a sledgehammer? Okay. Alright, get dunked on. 
Okay, I can't hit him. There we go. Took me a few swings, but I got it. I still have it. Something is right there in that room, and it is going to jump me as soon as I turn the corner. Oh, maybe I don't turn the corner yet. Maybe I'll wait. Tumblers today. Wow. Why did I grab the empty bottle? Shame. I shouldn't have done that. Okay. Miscellaneous. Bobbleheads. Let me get rid of some of that stuff. I had a plunger for some reason. I guess I had some things to unclog. First aid box, dirty water, stim pack. Motorcycle handbrake. Oh! Ah! 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 Oh! Get away! I don't like you guys. Stupid mole? Oh my god. Why did you jump scare me, brother? I, that sucked. Okay, gun cabinets are awesome to see, though. We haven't seen those. Toolbox, yeah, nothing really. Nothing really. Okay. Activate electrical switch. I'm assuming that's where the vault is. Assuming. But I just want to check the other rooms while I'm up here. Nuka Cola Quantum. It's just chilling there. Are you serious? Okay, switch. Activated. Weapon. Drawn. Oh. I don't want to play around with these guys. This is the first time we've had this much health. Give me that mole rat meat. Yeah. Okay. Door to vault 112. This is it. A hidden vault. There she is. Oh, it's blinking red. What does that mean? Let me get something bigger out. Dude, whoever's in here is going to be like, Hey, hey, what was this just supposed to happen? Hey! I'm going to have to let them know it's me. It's all good. This place is kind of clean. Uh, right or left? I, I guess let's check the office. That usually is always a good thing to do. Huh? It's just a pretty clean office, huh? Open door then. This isn't a bad vault so far. Welcome to Vault 112, resident. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind schedule. I had a schedule? Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault suit before proceeding. Whoa. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized I have to distribute a new one. Once dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your assigned Tranquility Lounger. Okay, excuse me? Please take a seat. I'm 203 years late, apparently. For what? Uh, let me put on my vault jumpsuit, because I am a bad bitch. I already have a vault 112 jumpsuit. Available tranquility lounger. I have one. Thank you for your cooperation. Sit in the tranquility lounger. You're going to need to explain some stuff to me before I sit. Okay. Define tranquil. 
Would it be? It wouldn't be in the clinic room, would it? Oh. Oh shit. Whoa. What is this place? Recon armor helmet. That looks pretty sick. So it's like some research was being done. X-rays being taken. Uh, jumpsuits laying there too. They're not even hostile though. I'm so confused. Three stim packs and a medex. Well, we did come into. Oh, I'm addicted to those. Let me eat one. I'm weaning off of it slowly. Okay, trust. Recon armor. Wasteland legendary outfit. Clipboard pack of cigarettes. So what did we get here? Recon armor, recon helmet. That's pretty sick. Increased sneak. We can't type anything on the keys. So that's the clinic. If that was that area let's go check the left side and it said to keep going further down if we want to um get into a tranquility pod Hello, overseer's office this is what i need i'm a little sneaky boy and i want to know what is going on here please contact an administrator okay you're gonna make this hard aren't you Maybe we can get a site, like on the bottom floor. What are, what are these little vials? Whoa! Dude, you're sitting up in the pod. You're bald. Are you, are you all bald? Is that a requirement? Do you all have to be like, fully shaven? I'm a hairy dude, that'd be pretty hard. Subject, P. Nesbaum, P. Nesbaum, oh, G. Nesbaum. Oh, it's a whole family right here. Lounger, monitor station. Display resident status. Pulse, 75 BPM. Respiratory state. Temperatures. Stress level, nominal. Cool. P, news bomb. 82 beat per minute. Eh, it's pretty hot though, isn't it? 97 degrees is nominal. Okay. It's not like the best ever, but it's not bad. Definitely pretty hot. 112 beats per minute. You're beating faster, buddy. Stress level nominal. Jade Rockwell. Pulse. BPM. Okay. Stress level elevated. You stressful old, di old guy, man? lady? I don't know. Rockwell R. Okay, so fairly normal. Stress level elevated. Why Why is your family like stressed right now? Are you okay? Oh, it wasn't she. You're the husband. I'm sorry. Lounger monitor. Unoccupied. Activate tranquility lounger. Whoa. We can sit in a pod? Hold up. I want to read a bit more about these guys if they have anything. Inconsistent readings. Check pod connections. Error. Anomaly detected. Stress level extreme. Requires medical attention. Robobrain, can you help them? I'm sorry, but I am not at liberty to chat right now. What are you watching? Oh. Monitor unknown. Pulse. Possible program corruption. Unable to uh, verify resident ID. Please contact a supervisor. Stress level elevated. Henderson M. PPM. Resident status. Okay, normal. M. Simpson. Homer! Let's go ahead and check their stress. Elevated as well. So there's only a few people that's nominal. Andrew's currently not occupied. Should have read. W. Foster, this might be the last one. 
72 beats per minute. Nothing unusual, I guess. Okay. So we checked all of these. I just have one question. Do you really expect me to sit in a pod? Am I supposed to just full on sit in a pod? I'm a little stressed. Like some of these people need medical help because they're indie pods. All right, well, here we go. I'm gonna sit in a pod, guys. Hello, man. Oh God. Please stand by. Okay. Whoa! I don't know. That's this TV's odd. Tranquility Lane. Wait, who am I? I am a little kid version of myself. Still suffering from withdrawals. Hey there, sport. Beautiful day, isn't it? Hey, George. Say, you should go talk to Betty. She's waiting for you over on the playground. Have fun, sport. Yeah, no worries. Well, hey, hi Pat. There. Have you seen my dad? What can you tell me about the neighborhood? This is a pretty convincing simulation. Should I just break the third wall? What? Oh, sweetie. Maybe you should just... Okay, sorry, I shouldn't have well, said that. Well, George and I have been here. Why, as long as I can remember. Have you seen my dad? No, sweetie, I haven't. Okay, that's all I need to know. I gotta go now. Bye. Hi there. Hey, I'm Timmy. Timmy. Wanna play? Um... No, this is real. It's all some crazy experiment. Can you tell me about the neighborhood? It's okay, I guess. I don't really have nobody to play with, except for Betty. And she's kind of, well, she's mean. How is she mean? Let's, let's tell him it's an experiment. What? Okay, I'm sorry. I shouldn't say that. I'm weirding people out. Okay, who are you? Hi, you kiddo. Bill? What's the good word? Nice day, isn't it? Yep, you've got that right. Heck of a day to get some work done outdoors. What can you nice tell me about place. the neighborhood? Real nice. Everyone's friendly and always happy to lend a hand. That's a pretty convincing simulation. Is that so? Well, you ought to tell that to my big toe, kiddo. Hurts like the dickens since I stubbed it earlier today. Okay. Feels pretty real to me. You're a jokester now. Hey, look at the garden home. Oh, we could go in their home? Roger. Hello, hey Roger. Hey there, little lady. How's it going? Sorry for walking in your home, but have you seen my dad? He disappeared on you, huh? Yes, he did. Can you tell me about the neighborhood? Heck of a place to live. Janet and I, well, we're quite happy here. Nice day, isn't it? You won't find a day like this anywhere else. Okay. No, this is real. It's a crazy sure, experiment. Sport, whatever. I have to go now. Good, Janet. good day to you. Have you seen my dad? No. No, this is real. I have to go. <laughs> That'd be so creepy. <laughs> Imagine a kid running into your house and just doing that. None of this is real. None of it's real. Okay. Hello, sweetie. How are you? Um, have you seen my dad? I don't think so. But then I haven't really been looking for him. Sorry. Okay, you cocky fuck. This is a simulation. Sorry. I'm out of here. Do you have anyone home with you? Mabel? Well, hi there. Have you seen my dad? No. I have to go now. <sighs> okay. I am done being a kiddo. I'm just going to step inside the playground. I can either find oh, that or find Betty. Oh, someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. And you are? I'm Betty. I live here on Tranquility Lane. Want to play a game? A game? Okay, I guess. I knew you would. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbum cry. 
Why would I want to do that? What? That's crazy. No, Timmy's the one who's crazy. You'll see. Make him cry. Okay, why do I need to make him cry? He has a nice lemonade stand. Henderson residence. Is this my residence? The Deathers. You, you don't belong here. You're not supposed to be here. It's not real. None of it. What? It needs to end. The suffering What's wrong? must end. Finally, someone who knows what's going on. How do I get out of here? We're not really here. We're not really talking. It's all made up. Make believe. We're sleeping, dreaming. The dream yes. became a nightmare. It has to end. It just has to. But we're not in charge. He is. And he doesn't want us to wake Who's up. Who's he? Who are you talking about? He calls himself Betty now, but he's still the same. He can put on a new face all he likes, but underneath he's still evil. Braun. Bastard thinks because he didn't create this place, he's God here. But I know he still uses the fail-safe terminal. I know it. What fail-safe? What the hell are you talking about? It's in the abandoned house. He doesn't want us going in there because he's afraid we might find it. It's the only terminal to the outside. The only way to shut I the save whole these people. thing down. You've got to find it. Okay. Old lady with uh, old lady Dithers, I will do this for you. And I will save you. Where's the home? It's in there. Has to be. Has to be in there. Where's the home? Is it this one? Abandoned house. I'm gonna enter it. Oh no. Oh no. Is it upstairs? No one's hearing me. Oh, this place is torn up though. What? There's no terminal, I'm sorry. I can't save you. Ow. I don't think I can save her, there's no terminal. Seriously? Activate empty bottle. What? to activate this not that do I need to go to where where do I need to go now is there anything else that I can activate hey we get zero rads when we're in here we can drink I uh, can even drink from the toilet okay hold up hold up hold up hold up this is gonna make a secret happen I know it I feel it in my bones one two Three. Oh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Nope. One, two, three. Is there anything upstairs that I can do? I don't want to miss anything. Okay, no. So it's all down there. Whatever it is has to be with these.
So it only starts with that one. Goes there. Back to glass. Cinder block. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Ha, ah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yo! Let's go. Auxiliary command terminal, access Chinese invasion program, access version control, Dr. Braun, Toucan Lagoon. I finally come to the realization that Toucan Lagoon simulation has run its course. I'm tired of the beating sun and the ceaseless pounding of the lagoon's waves upon the shore. I no longer take pleasure in watching Simpson wither away from scurvy or hearing Nesbaum screams as he's devoured by the Mako shark. I am quite simply bored. It is time to reset the simulation once again. I haven't been skiing in ages. Oh no. Yesterday, Dither slipped on the shallot's icy stairs, went airborne, and managed to impale herself on the wrought iron fence. It was spectacular and completely and utterly random. Is there anything more sublime than that bold crimson on fresh fallen snow? It was almost enough to make me reconsider a change of scenery, but not quite. 23 years is a long enough vacation in the Swiss Alps. I long for something more domestic. This is so fucked up. I have surprised myself. I find Tranquility Lane comforting, although distinctly American. It somehow reminds me of the Kronach, the town of my childhood. There's a beautiful irony with this particular simulation as well. The residents here are naturally at home, naturally safe. When I toy with them, when their er er suburban illusion is suddenly broken, it's that much more satisfying. I do believe we shall all remain here in Tranquility Lane for a very long time. A very long time indeed Jesus Christ so I can either access the Chinese invasion program or access version control let's go version display previous version notes tranquility lane loaded all previous versions wiped S brawn display current version exceptions granted for pod 001 manual override for pods disabled remove remote access allowed user brawn has privileges updated neural inputs to override memory Revised code for vault maintenance. Okay. Well, you didn't revise it too well because I am easily in here. Initiate Chinese invasion failsafe. Failsafe program documentation. Dr. Braun, here's the revised code for the military training program you've uh, expressed interest in. I'm not sure exactly what you want with it. And again, uh, I again stress that this program was never designed to be run with civilian equipment. Frankly, I don't expect any system you have. Uh, access to can even run it, but if you can run the program with fail safes off as requested your real-world test subjects will die if killed in the simulation It goes without saying that officially I denied your request General Constantine Chase, <laughs> okay. Yeah, I deny it too new protocols disable safety mm. Mm. Extreme caution Dr. Brown entry fail safe there are days I consider finally pulling the plug as it were and putting a permanent end to both the simulation and my life. That is the reason I requested installation of General Chase's Chinese invasion program. After all, by disabling the safety protocols, I have ensured that each subject in Vault 12 will physically die if their in simulation avatars are killed. Real world death, end of simulation. The perfect failsafe. At least it would have been if not for my own. At least it would have been if not for them meddling kids! I knew when the simulation first went online that the secondary fail say, or secondary safeties those established for all vault tech and military personnel would prevent my own real world demise in the event of a fail safe execution. In the end, I would kill the subjects and save myself. I wouldn't want it any other way, or so I thought. It's true the fail safe would scare the living hell out of every resident in Tranquility Lane and lead to their brutal deaths, but then what about me? I have no ability to disable my own safety from within the simulation. And any other avatars I could create would be driven by the simulations, AI, routines, not actual living, thinking human subjects. Where's the fun in tormenting a machine? 
And so the release of a real world subject is more than they deserve, more than I could bear. They'd be dead and I'd be left here in tranquility lane alone, tragically bored for all eternity. I could think of nothing more unacceptable. Should we initiate it and kill him? Program running, proceed with caution. Oh no. Oh no. I'm going to kill a kid. 